This is the Herald Allure 5 and it's our 2021 Stove of the Year. Hi, I'm Gabriel. My family have been manufacturing, designing and selling stoves for three generations. And this channel has two sides, stove reviews and information and mini films about successful people and their life-changing wisdom. Check them out and leave me a comment. You could also like and subscribe to see more. There are currently three models in the Allure range, but more are coming. They all have direct air. They're all officially rated at 4.9 kilowatts, which means you don't need an air vent in a house built before 2008. Uh, it starts at the Allure 4, which is the little one. There's this one, which is the Allure 5, and then a widescreen Allure 7. And they're all designed for wood burning. Leave it just a jar and the vent open. You get some gloves with the stove, which you will need because the controls do get warm. You've got a main control at the bottom, all the way to the right for full power, and uh, all the way to the left to shut it down and as you can see it does properly close it down and douse those flames. I tend to run it with just a nudge back as this gives good fuel economy but also keeps that glass and the look and the flames still working. The main handle is very neatly hidden away here and you do need a firm wrist, you do have to push it hard but it shuts lovely and looks very smart and discreet, and discreet. Well, firstly, the glass is huge and obviously it runs spotlessly clean. It did go black overnight when we shut it down, but the following day when we opened it up, it did completely clear the glass. This stove is for pretty much anyone who likes the look of it. We found the Allure for as little as 699, including VAT and delivery. So it's not expensive, it's controllable, it's clean, it's efficient, it runs overnight, it's a joy to use, it's fantastic. We take a five pound net of logs and see how long we can maintain operating temperature with that net. This stove did it for 15 hours, which for a mid-cost stove is absolutely unheard of. And the last load with three logs burned for 10 hours. The handle does get hot and you do need some wrist strength to operate it. But other than that minor point, it's completely superb. It's clean, it's economical to buy and to run, it's 80% efficient, there's DEFRA approval, eco-design, and it has those magical floating flames. 